Yo. Right. Right. I've been doing a little bit of tidying up. A little bit of tidying up, but there's a lot more that I need to do. But, back on Enigmatica, which is making me happy. So, I have been tidying up and getting everything prepped, ready. Hopefully the music's not too loud. Please let me know if it is, because I'm still trying to get used to the new settings for Pretzel. Um, but I have been tidying up a little bit. So we've started getting a little farm going. Because I'm not doing it outside. Screw outside. Nope, the music is not too loud. Thank you, Delirious. Wait a minute, I've got to do that again. Just because it's you. There we go. While I have a zombie pigman growling at me. Where are you? Stop it. No. no. Ow. Stop it. There we go. Yeah, because it's starting to get a little bit messy out here. So I kind of want to tidy it up a bit. Because that's all working. Oh, yeah, I did have wheat during, didn't I? Oh, well, never mind. It doesn't take up too much. Not a problem. Um, why are you not at your market? Hey, buddy. There we go. Oh, yeah, he's an emerald muncher. Okay. Bit disturbing. So I kind of really want to start getting everything finished. Um, I need to go get a couple more trees. Because I definitely don't need sticks from those. But I will take the wood. Because no doubt I'll have a use for it at some point. If not, never mind. I've got shit loads of wood. That's not a problem. So we've got Arcadia saplings. We haven't got spruce, actually. Let's go get some spruce. Why am I not running? Come on, run, you fool. Oh, hello. Jesus. What's he got? Trecapitator? Well, no. Bolts? Really? You want 32 and more for Jesus, Mr. Elephant. I don't want to get that close to your bum. That elephant was getting a little bit too friendly. Right, let's get some spruce saplings. There we go. Right. So we've got spruce. What else can we find? Got oak already. There must be some other saplings we can find. I keep forgetting I've moved the map as well so you guys can see it on stream. So I keep looking in the wrong corner. That's a good point, actually. I need to come and see your base very soon, Jay, if that's alright. Ah, is that the tree I'm looking for? So I have the wood for it, I just don't have the saplings. I think it might be. Yes, rainbow eucalyptus. There we go. Right, can I use that in the woot? I can use that in wood. Get in. Two types of power. Just need to come up with the layout. Ooh. Okay, I definitely need to come and have a look. Because I was going to set up power today. But not power power. Actual power. The name of the mod. I don't know if you've seen that one yet. Right, let's go back to base. Let's maybe swing by and kill this skelly bob. If he's overground. He's not overground. Fine. I'm not going hunting for you. I'll wait until the apocalypse starts in this again. Your power is normal. Your power is normal. So much power. Well, I mean, I can't go crazy with power storage this time. Because there is no draconic evolution in this pack. But there is a mod called power. Literally P O W A D A H. -H, 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 -H. So, I want to try that, because I've had a quick read-up about it, and I think I know what I want to go for. It's just whether or not I can pull it off. Right, let's get those out of the way. I need two more thingies. So, let's make some more drawers. I do not know what they Should work with them as well. It does. Get in. Right. Birch. Can't be 
thought it's broke, but never mind. Does that have the heater generate power from heat? It has a thermo thermoelectric one, yeah. If that's the one you're thinking of. Because you've also got the heater from mechanism. Which I think is the one more that you're talking about. This one you like put it over a block and it just passively generates power. But you have to give it water as well. So you have to cool it down. <coughs> Mech is the one I'm thinking. Uh, yeah, see these ones are upgradable. Uh, excuse me. Plant, thank you. There we go. Okay, that's all done. No coughing, not allowed. Why did it scare you? Hydrate. Oh, damn it. Did the coughing scare you? Because you know I've just generally got a cough from being a naughty smoker for years. Morak! How you doing? Oh, actually, now you're both here, I have tried that new event, and yeah, I'm not impressed. I understand exactly what, what you're saying now. It's, it's okay, but it's... Mm. Mm. The hypostasis one, yeah. I'm gutted as well, because I just literally by like five minutes missed out on actually completing the Lost Treasures one. So I didn't get one of the little sealies in the end. And I'm really gutted about that. I know they don't really have a use, but that's not the point. I had enough coins, I just hadn't... I had like one more thing to find in the 14th or the last day. And I just didn't find it. So, boo. Right, let's put those away. That's gonna, I can just see that becoming a very noisy room at some point. With all of the trees. Right. So, let's start having a look at... That's now done. Basic storage is still over here for a moment. Until I work out what I want to do next. And I've already dug out the machine room. Which makes me happy. I just need to build a decent area. We tried the Geo Hypo event yesterday, and that was complete BS. In what way was it complete BS? I mean, I just quickly did it just to get the gems. So I just put it on the lowest thing and ticked one box and went, yep, yeah, give me the gems. I'll come back and do something properly later. Because screw doing it properly right now. Uh, I don't want to do any of that yet. I kind of need a room big enough to put all the machines in. So I don't think this is actually big enough. Maybe. Hmm. Random earthquakes, pillars firing up. It was impossible with two people with characters at level 90. Wow. What difficulty did you have it on? Ah, coffee good. Especially now I've had my um, coffee syrup turn up. Uh, gold greaves of latent magic. Okay. Um kind of need to figure out what I'm doing. Right, let's have a look at power. We tried hard an expert. Oh, okay. I'll have to give that a go. Because I haven't actually done any of it yet. Right, so I need a lot more iron. Really? I need to make two of each one? What is this? Energized steel. Which, okay. I need an energizing rod. Oh, uh. George says BS stands for beautiful sister. <laughs> oh, bless you. How are you doing, cat? Hello, George. Where? What power was I going to use? It's that one. So I need many of these little tiny capacitors. Okay. Can I do it with copper as well as iron? I can. Thank God for that. I've got loads of copper. Right, that should be enough. Oh, maybe not. I haven't got enough of that. Damn it. Oh well. Need to start getting all of the RS stuff started as well, so I can actually get rid of these boxes. Um, okay, so I need to make 
casing, which... Didn't I make one of those and have one spare? Didn't I? I can't actually remember. I've got loads of energy cables. Ah, yes. I have the casing and I have these. Let's grab all of this stuff out. Can I upgrade those to like standard cables? No. Oh, those ones are on upgrade. Oh, really? Okay, I may I may leave those alone. No, oh, no, I need to upgrade them. Damn it! Ah, I need to make some more of that paste. So blaze powder, clay, and that. Okay, I can do that. Oh, really? Have I run out? No, can't have run out. Let's just make sure they're marked so I don't accidentally empty them. There we go. Got loads of coal. Okay, let's do it the easy way. Let's get rid of those. Make a couple more. Uh, yeah. Let's move the bed downstairs for now. Loads of oak wood. Yep, that'll do. Let's make loads of charcoal. See if there's anything in the books. Oh, I did finally upgrade the hammer, by the way, Jay. So if you want to get your hammer upgraded, I can show you how to do it. I think I need to go to the end before I get the next one. See, I've done that, and it knows I have, because it's given me the re reward. Hmm. Nearly. Nearly got me. <laughs> Very close. Which hammer? Breaking 3x3 three three or one crafting in a different mod? No, no, no. The Tetra hammer. Upping it to tier 5. I finally got round to figuring it out, so... I have done my one. I've actually left everything in the ha that forge as well, in case you wanted to do yours. Ah, coffee nice. That's a good point. Where's the manual power? Power manual, there we go. Got power storage, functional blocks. There's a block for use to wireless. Oh, okay, fine. So that'll just charge whatever I've got on me. Nice. Energizing orb is a block used to energize items. Require at least one energizing rod in a range of nine by nine to work. 
The energizing speed depends on the amount of rods and the rod tier. The orb does not require energy, but the, orb, but the rods must be placed on cables or any force energy block to work. Okay. Placing the orb rod in range will automatically link to each other. Also, you can use the wrench to link mode. Oh, okay, fine. So I can move stuff around. That's not a problem. They go up to ridiculous levels. Which is fine. I like this. So, generators. We've got furnators, magmators, thermogenerators, solar panels, and reactors. Uh... I mean, the solar panel would be nice, but that means losing a load of space outside. The thermo one is... That's the one that gets it off a high temp block. They require a coolant like water to run. So, I need to figure out whether or not those fluid pumps from Immersive work. Because if they do... Oh my god, I'm shouting at my own game now. Damn you, caps lock. I think I've got a load of iron plates already. Yes, okay, so. Let's get that bit done. I need two more. Four more, okay, fine. Luckily, I have a machine for this. Dude on the elephant is properly freaking out over there. Give me the item, thank you. Actually, dropping conveyor belt. Trap door and a conveyor belt. Let's go get that done. I'm sure I've got some spares. I'm sure I've got some spares. Of course it's that. Should work. Only one way to find out, I guess. Let's hope it doesn't throw everything all over the place. Right, because that should work as a water tank. I hope. Make basic tank in that day. One way to find out. Because if that this works and it allows me to interact with the other thing, then I'm happy. This should work. Help me 
up before I actually configure it. Uh, where's my ammo? Am I going blind? It's not that. Damn it. So I'm hoping that these work together. I'm hoping. There it is. Fluid output. There we go. That should work. Wait a minute, I heard a noise. No, nope, that was something else. Oh, yep, it's those things. Hello. Where's the book for it gone? Maybe I should sleep. Actually, I haven't slept in ages. I think that's why they're coming along. Ah, there we go. No, I did have a book on me. There it is. Right. Fluid router? No. Where's the pump? It's not it's definitely not the pump jack. Right. Fluid pumps have three essential functions. They can be used to insert into pipes at high pressure to transfer fluid much faster, or they can pick up fluids from the world. Using your hammer on the base of the pump will switch the sides in between in and output. In order to, for the pump to pick up fluid blocks, it needs a power input at the top and a red and a redstone signal. Okay. Right. That'll be why it doesn't bloody work. No? Okay, so that's definitely the right thing. Oh my god, it was as easy as that. Okay, so that definitely works. Do you know what? I'm going to go kill that random dude on the elephant because he's starting to bug me. Your prices are too high. chest and some cave centipede leg. What? Where did that come from? Okay. Murderer. <laughs> no. He, he, he was a rip-off merchant. He was trying to steal some... I, I don't know. I can't even make it up anymore. I, I did go and kill him. Can't really deny it, can I? Okay, so I know that works. I'm totally not trying to distract everyone from the fact I just murdered that thing. Uh, so, if that works, and. Uh, 
Because if this generates enough power, then I don't need to do the other thing either, which is good. I don't need to worry about trying to make some immersive power gen. Um, so it's that I want to make. Which, oh, I should have loads of that now. These should all be done. blaze rods I do right can I put them in a crusher yes and I get four okay that will work let's do two of them for now let me through the door damn it was quick. Nice. Yeah, I don't need all of it. I only need some. There we go. Right. So, three dielectric packs. Do you know what? Let's make... Oh. Okay, I'll go pick that up in a minute. Maybe a golden one will work. Two weeks away from Genshin 1.3. Oh my god, it is two weeks, isn't it? Have you been looking into what it is we get in two weeks with 1.3? I know I'm going to be spending a lot of money when that one comes out. A lot of money. But it's for a good cause. Dielectric casing. All the things in a Zama. Yes! I cannot wait. Because that should mean that the Traveller gets a new power. And I can't wait to play with that. Also means there'll be loads of opportunity for me to actually level up my other characters and do other stuff. Try and get them all to 90. Super excited. I know. We may have to do it. Because we haven't done it yet, and I know we talked about it. We may have to do it that we just like sit in Discord, geeking out over all of it. Sup, my guy, Asim Famiku. Hey, my back hurts. How are you, man? Basic capacitor tiny. There we go. I should get two of them from that, I think. I do. Okay, good. There's those. And thermo plates. Okay, so I need three of those. So I need one more of them. Uh, need some redstone. So 12 redstone. Oh, and I need to get three more of those done. I definitely need to go farm some blaze rods in a minute. It's going to have to be done. I'm good, how about you? I am good, thank you. Back on this. Back trying to figure out some stuff. And at the same time, mess around. Hopefully try and get my, my base looking a little bit better today. Did some work on it already. There we go. Right, here we go. Thermoelectric generator starter. Doesn't do much, but it does enough. And the question is, can I use it in conjunction with immersive engineering? Because I should be able to. Oh, custom packs are sick. I know. I do like this one. Uh, energy cell. 
Okay, we've got some advanced ones, so let's see how quickly that can charge. We've got some energy cable as well. So that should work. I just need... Uh, let's try it with a magma block to start with. Shouldn't be too bad. It's going to be a horrendous placement, but I don't care. It's just to test things at the moment. <gasps> okay. It works and it connects. That makes me happy because there's no like weird stuff. Uh, battle pass will have risen. What? Wait a minute. I said risen, but resin? Seriously? Seriously? They're going to put resin rewards in there now. <coughs> it's about damn time. I've already maxed out the battle pass. So needed. N10 levels of resin. What? Uh, one of the little recharge thingies. Are they increasing the levels though? Because they really need to. Okay, so direct connection works. What about... Oh, these pipes look weird. Oh, so happy all of that works together. Okay. And because of the infinite water source mechanics on Minecraft, that will just work. So I can have a couple of those. Can I power it from that though? I wonder. So if I was to put that there. Get rid of that. Give me back my cable. Alright. Wow. Okay. I properly dive bomb the floor then. It does work. Oh, that's a game changer. How much is that generating? 18 RF per tick. Really? Is that it? It's not a lot. Is it faster with lava, I wonder? Let's go put this away and go find some lava. Uh, most players haven't even reached 90. Oh, well, yeah, true. I mean... I don't know why, but the 16.5 update didn't bring much. No, I think that fixed most of their little bugs they had for all duplication in uh, vanilla. I mean, I love that they've put the battle pass in there. I think it's an awesome idea, and a lot more games should do it, especially when they've got long-standing content like that. But when it's very easy to max it out, and once you hit 50, that's it, and they're adamant that you should you should easily be able to hit 50 within the four week window i think it is they give or like five week window i hit it within a week or a half well a week or a week and a half because you can earn ten thousand a week and if you pay for their like pass as well you just jump start everything and there's no point this is like okay i can just grind that not a problem I think a week is an understatement. I've done my maths wrong, but hopefully you guys know what I mean as you play it. I'm still totally not sorry I got you hooked on that, by the way. Or introduced you to it, at least. Right. So if that works, let's go get a bucket or two, or maybe another tank, actually. Let's go get some lava. I think that's the right recipe. Yes, it is. Right. What else do we need? I don't think there's anything else I need right now. Let's just go get some lava. They really need another way, even if it's like really, really slow, of earning. Um, primo gems. I know they. I know they want you to pay, which is fine, and I get. I get that because having that in means that they're getting more money, so they can do more stuff, which is um, amazing. But it it'll take you a good month or two. <coughs> My Genshin needs are all your fault. Now I play pretty much every evening. I mean, cat. 
you, you say it's a bad thing, but I have offered to come and help batter bosses for you, especially now my character is level 90. I think the only ones I can't join you on is the dragon and um, child. All the rest I can join you on. I still wish we could play together. I know. <laughs> That's a gif and a half. Oh, pants. You just reminded me. Right, I'm going to do a very, very... You can team up on child. Nice. I'm going to do a very, very quick test. So I really hope it doesn't mess with the stream. But I, f I completely told Eli I was going to do something and then completely forgot to do it. So let me just try something. And can you let me know if the quality dips? I hope it doesn't. But you never know. Right. Let's see what happens. I've just run past the lava. That was not good. Oh well. Means I've missed the start. What a shame. Well, right. oh, give me the lava. Let's see if lava does any more. That's a good point. Jay, have you actually started doing any of the story in Genshin yet? Because if not, there's now like four of us here that can team up on you on that one. <laughs> I thought you'd like that cat. Right. No, don't don't take out the don't want the water. Fool of a took. I know I finished up to beating child. So you've done most of it then. Really? Fifteen per tick. That's not actually that much better. It looks like it works better with a magma block. Yeah, it does. Okay. Stick him with magma then. Cheers, babe. Remember, I beat him before you, though. Oh! -ho. Jay, you do realise you're replying in Minecraft, and she may only just about see it on the screen. Right, let's get rid of that. Not while you're reading it out. Uh, very good point, dude. That's not the that's not the case. It's not the point, sorry. I still haven't finished getting all the chests actually in the uh, in the other place. I need to do that. It takes ages though. Right. That's all up and running, which makes me happy. We figured out power. Just need to figure, figure out a power room now. Because a couple of these should do it, I think. Maybe three? Maybe? I do know I will need some more fluid pipes. Yeah, I definitely need to move the machines indoors. Running back and forth constantly is painful. I kind of want to keep going that way, but at the same time, I kind of want the machine room to be lower than this. Well, that was definitely not what I wanted to do. There we go. Okay.
What? I haven't got a torch down here. What's going on? Why have I got light? <coughs> well, that's my old mine. This could be difficult. Oh well. Oh, Jay, have you unlocked any more trinkets yet, mate? Just curious what the rest of them are. Only one more lunch bag. Yeah, I got that one. A chance of getting a small buff of saturation potion when eating. I did also get Butcher's Cleaver and Magneto. <coughs> Ow. Magneto's quite nice. Because it lets me do this. Uh, yeah, there you go. Just call all the items to me. Okay, so that's all of that dug up. Give me all the items. Thank you. think that room could be wider underneath if it's going to have power in some of the bigger machines maybe Some feral lamps. There's only 12 of those. I'm trying to work it out in my head. It helps if I can remember the recipe. Okay. I'm 
doing? Oh, it can be silver or gold. And glass. There we go. We ordered food, got pierogies, Brussels sprouts and chocolate cake. Oh, nice. Very nice. I'm really tempted to make another crumble this week. But I need to go buy some custard first. Can't have a crumble without custard. And I've forgotten where the blocks go again. Let's do the easy way. Let's make holes in the floor. Very jealous of the food. <laughs> Look over and just see cats on spaceships. Actually, what day is, is Genshin Update Day? What day of the week? Oh, it's a Wednesday. I might have to see if I can book it off. Spend the whole day playing Genshin. Just because I can. Hey, Christian, how's it going, man? How are you? Kind of don't want to 
use the marble. I'm good, mate. How's things? Oh, it's manic, mate. Today was just an utter, utter butt. It's the only way that I could describe it. It was just an utter butt. start at six o'clock in the morning tomorrow so it's gonna be fun why is that longer than I thought it was thought I did it exact oh no I didn't do it exact what did I where's the arm there it is Utter, utter butt. Especially with all the silliness for next gen. It's also why the rest of my week is going to be fairly manic. But oh well, never mind. It is what it is. How's your day been, buddy? Sending love, dude. Oh, thanks, man. It'll hopefully sort itself out at some point. Hopefully. One can hope, right? Actually, where's my exchanger gone? Because I should be able to charge that now. Now is it in tools? There it is. Right. I should be able to use this. Oh, I can charge it. Awesome. PSP and DS launch for hell. 30 to 40 calls a day if we ask them if you have one. Oh. I miss those days. Because I used to work in store actually when the DS and the PSP launched. I've still got my old PSP somewhere. And my DS actually. But... This is just beyond, beyond ridiculous. I think like half an hour and we had 150,000 people waiting in the queue online. So it's been a little manic. It's only going to get worse. Oof, yeah, oof. That was after, I'm pretty sure that was after like 10 minutes of saying yes, we have it. Oh well. Never mind. It's not turned me it's not turned me fully to drinking yet. Ah, coffee. Wow, that is taking an age to charge. Okay, while we're waiting for that to charge, I'll do it the manual way. Just because. Don't like there's whiskey in that coffee. <laughs> oh no, unfortunately not. No whiskey in there. I think you'd be even more shocked at that I don't drink as much as I used to anymore. That sounds really bad. I'm not allowed to drink really anymore. I can be sensible and have a, a couple every now and then. I 
hopefully the stream quality has been okay because I have pressed the record button now. It may have been 40 minutes too late, but we won't tell Buster that. Don't have money to afford the drink. I don't really either, but oh well. Of course I missed one, there we go. Well, I think maybe nine high for this would do it, maybe. So let's make sure I grab that first. have a corner in the kitchen where the booze is there's a bottle of JD that still hasn't been opened and we got that last Christmas oh dear gone are our really really silly days cat I nearly forgot about the ceiling whoops One side done. Need some more blocks there. Jess! Hi Jesse, how are you? I can't read that without hearing both you and Plaz saying it. <laughs> oh, I'm glad to hear you're okay. You get to see some of the silliness that I've been doing now, after I died a couple of times on your server yesterday. That was highly entertaining. <laughs> God, it's been ages since I played vanilla, so I'm like trying to find a map and trying to remember how to play vanilla. That's what I'm put that's what I'm blaming it on. I'm too used to having maps. Oh, <laughs> 
good over there. No. I mean, of course I'm going to jump onto yours just to do some random building stuff, but I do love me some modded. Did you get your spawner built? Oh my god. Thank you for the host. Oh, I fell down again. Just realised, having those caves under there is really going to start bugging me. The guys did. It went nuts. <laughs> I did see it went a little bit crazy with spawning in them. You didn't see that. You saw nothing. Uh, I did see it went a little bit crazy with the amount of endermen that spawned. Because you like had a whole full inventory of enderpearls at one point. Is that all of it done? No, there's a gap there. I see it. Wow, that was a terrible placement. Did I put two? I put two down. How did I manage that? <coughs> it was intense. <laughs> Mark just staring. Made a waste disposal. A waste disposal? What are you making too much of? Dare I even ask? Those ender pearls. Oh my god. <gasps> I just unlocked a new trinket. Ooh. Let's remove lunch bag. What is slingshot? Dealing more not back when hitting enemies. Oh, yes, please. Thank you. Send those enemies flying. I may have to steal that uh, end of hell set up in this because I don't think there's proper like mob spawners in this one. But in all fairness, I think I can't remember if, if you saw them last time. But you know, I said there was those random multi-block um, machines that you can build in this. Oh wow, that's a lot of random stuff. It's been all that. It was Emma who did all the hard work. I was trying to save my dad. Did you get it set up in the end? Is he all back up and running now? Hopefully he is. Um, yeah, multi-block machines. Actually, let's let's put some stuff in it. Uh, let's put all the gold in it. Nope, he managed to sort it out himself. Oh. So yeah, nice multi-block machines. Munching away, duplicating gold for me. That's one of the smaller machines in this pack. There are some much crazier ones. Much, much crazier ones. Um, I don't know why I keep putting the manuals away in there. I probably want them on my on me. Where is it? Let's see if I can find the excavator, because that's the one that always makes me laugh. Heavy machinery, there we go. Excavator. Oop, excuse me, thank you. Because that has a... That's just a giant drill. Or oh, not drill, what's the name of it? Just a basic miner in this. That just goes a little bit nuts. There's some other ones as well. I need to see if you can make flywheels in this one. Because they're really nice energy storage. Right. Back to digging up the new bit for the new machines. I am going to be setting up a lot of those machines down here with the conveyor belts as well, just because I can. So much copper down here. Why is there not enough the same like volume of iron? that 
that off. wish there was faster hammers. should probably start make, maybe looking at making the drill. That might be a little bit better. Maybe. work and it's not, it's Twitter. I'm trying to think. So this room would be for all the big machinery, the power gen, big part of the storage. I need to build a room for bees and figure out whether or not they did just abandon their hive or if it's they died. Because most of the bees I've caught are not there anymore. Which makes me sad. So I had iron bees there as well. feeling they stay so long as you keep them boxed in. Well this is it, they were there for days. And it's it's the one I put in last, Jamie, that disappeared last, which makes me think it's that it's more oh hello. Is my inventory full? Oh whoops it is. Damn it. Let's get rid of that. There we go. So there is no bees to show me. I mean, we can go take a look at Jamie's base. He has bees. He's even put them in their own special little like bee hotel. I just have no bees because they either left me or they died. Because I know they're meant to die out, because it's kind of similar to the forestry mechanics, but I need to have a look through it a bit more, figure it all out. It's not you, it's the bees. <laughs> yeah, it's totally the bees. They're annoyed at how much time I've spent with the other type of Minecraft bees from other mod packs. Probably should mine out all the ore in here as well, but I know I'll be there for ages. 
have a new mining technique that works quite nicely. It's just very messy and disruptive. So I do it nowhere near my base. Oh, uh, Morak Delirious, I've nearly got enough saved up to do another set of wishes to try and get Ganyu. What well, will be my first set of wishes to try and get Ganyu, actually. So I'm kind of hoping the game's going to be really, really nice to me and give me Ganyu. Otherwise, I am going to end up spending loads of money. Because I'm not missing out on another character. I've already missed out on Albedo. You need to send him some good luck. All the complex machines just to make me want to play Space Engineers. Oh, nice. I don't think I've played Space Engineers. That's why I'm a big fan of a lot of the tech packs in Minecraft, just for the some, especially for the multi-block ones. Those always look really, really nice. so many games to play but it's Minecraft I have to Space Engineers is Kerbal Space Program in Minecraft Ooh. I will add that to the list to check out I've still got the like early access. I think it's still in early access anyway for Satisfactory. I've played it a little bit, but I always come back to this. Always. It's just so relaxing to just sit there and mine one night. Well, providing you can get better tools than the one I've currently got. Satisfactory, Morak and I played till there was no more. I, haven't they done like a massive update on it though recently? That that could be dangerous down there. Um, I'm definitely not Leroying my way down there. Check, but want to wait until it's done. Oh, okay. 
I mean, I was thinking the same thing about Edge of Eternity, because I know you, I don't know if you saw me playing that one. I do want to go back to that at some point. It's not a builder's game. It's just this amazing-looking RPG that I've been absolutely obsessed with for a while. But I know they're doing massive updates for it. And it's like, well, I could carry on playing it, but then they might add stuff again at the beginning. Because that's what caused me to restart last time. They added a prelude. So I'm like, right, okay, I've got to delete my save and go back. I'll only get annoyed if I don't. Damn you, dig. Thank you. this we can we can dig this out and I can start planning where all the everything's gonna go so that's definitely a big enough room for these machines I think well I hope so be a bit crazy if it's not Definitely gonna go make another coffee. I shall be back in just a moment. I shall leave you with the chair though. Because definitely need a coffee.
That's better. Oh, Jeff. Couldn't help it. Needed new needed an extra coffee. This one may be a little bit stronger. But coffee is always a good thing. Well no Alice is working. Hi Jeff. Yes, I'm no longer AFK again. I'm back. Don't worry. I is here. Stupid inventory. Get in there. There we go. Get rid of the ladders. I've got like nearly a stack of tin on me. There we go. Oh, Jeff, have you been playing the new um? Drive Syndicate on asphalt. And if you're not in a in a crew yet, mate, we do still have a space in our one. Now that I've changed it to invite only. Why am I doing that? We are watching you. What? What do you mean you are watching me? What are you doing? Hello, Amy. How you doing? <laughs> I 
How are you doing, my queen? What? Why is there so much iron behind there? Stupid thing. Nope. Get rid of that. Thank you. Oh dear. Fine, we're getting entertained by you. <laughs> oh, bless you. How was your day off? You were off today, weren't you? I'm sure you were. I'm sure you were off today. Yes. Oh, nice. Do you get up too much or do you just like have a chill one? It's definitely handy. headache so chill also say hi to my stream for me with your beautiful stare there you go <laughs> well hopefully your headache's gone now we've started to ease off a little bit so much down here. I'll have that copper too, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, just achy eyes. My SMP got blown up by a hacker. Now I'm on a recovery trip and ended up dying three. Oh no. Milo loved your stare. <laughs> Thank you. Right. Let's go and get this built. Don't you dare do that. There we go. What are you up to today anyway? Right. Thanks for being my content there. Now my update is finished. <laughs> Back onto Faz. <laughs> no worries. You need to, like, leave Ollie to get killed at least once. <laughs> Just because. Literally streaming you on my channel now. I kind of guessed that, because I do have my laptop open to, next to me. What? Remove camouflage? I want to be able to see that, otherwise I'm never going to find the damn elevator again. 
<laughs> Damn it now, no fun. Uh, well, I learned this last time someone did it to me, if you remember. Love you and I like now. No worries. Hope you have an awesome stream. I shall keep lurking there too, don't you worry. That's nearly done. Really? Really? Stupid block. like two of the three bees I had in here are no more. Yeah, I think they actually die, mate. I do think they, like, kind of give up. And you have to, like, get more of the same bee to keep them going. Because I know, like, Forestry had it that you had to, like, get, um... What was it? You had to use drones and princesses. Iron Bee didn't hang around long enough to give me any combs. Oh, no. I mean, this is it. I'm, I'm hoping there's a manual in the game for this, for the bees anyway. Because um, I'm pretty sure they've got like, kind of like how forestry bees work. They have certain requirements, like having certain flowers around them or um, having certain blocks near them and stuff like that. I think. Don't quote me on this. sure that's how it works. Well, I can at least go bee hunting today, actually, because I need some more bees. I've dismantled all the hives to try and upgrade them, but I can't keep upgrading them unless I keep having bees. So I'm going to see if I can find some default Minecraft ones. Maybe they'll keep going. to make a greenhouse for them though or like a special bee room I guess there we go right machine room is built for the big machines and the power so I kind of want to do kind of got an idea that the power I may not need that many but hmm because dead center is here. That's dead center. So let's just mark it. So I could do that there. Looks at the shifted flower selection for the IMB. I had flowers listed in the room and it's still and it still go poof. Okay. Yeah, I think they just like naturally die. Oh of course this opens out into this. Okay. I'm not dealing with that right now. But there's my markers at least. Looks like a bit annoying having to go find more just to try and get more materials. Well, I don't think you have to keep doing them. Gareth from here, but Emily is live. I was making fun of Brits all day today, but I love you all anyway. I see how it is, Jeff. Nice, nah, no worries, man. What were you making fun of us for, actually? That'd be interesting to know.
Now we have a client that has an office in Hemel Hempstead. Oh yeah, I remember the one you said before, actually. Right. So, power's that way. Or should I do power that way? How close am I to this? There's my map. I've still got room on the chunks. Hmm. They're writing a manual, so how you all lose caution is not how we use it in mill manuals. Oh, okay. I think I get you. Right. Let's put all this shit away. And now we've got the power thing working. I need to probably make a few more of those. I'm thinking maybe eight of them? Maybe? Actually, how many blocks is in between that? Oh, that's not going to work out exactly, is it? Um, 10, 12. Okay, there's 12 in between that. You can have water pumps on either side. Those going through. Maybe 24 of them? Might be a little bit too much. I think it's funny that Brits can't say Irish wristwatch three times fast. I'm not even going to do it, man. I will happily, happily admit I will fail on that. <laughs> I can't even talk at the best of times, let alone trying to say something that's a tongue twister. <laughs> I will happily be made fun of for that. But it's fine, I have my coffee, so I'm happy. It's a hard one. Yeah, especially when you can't talk properly. Ooh, okay. These are definitely working. I have a whole thing of cucumbers here as well. It's fine. He still has his dignity. I lost that years ago. <laughs> Streamers have dignity? No, no. <gasps> Talking streams, Del. Talking streams. Is it Friday that I have to be ready with all the uh, dubious amounts of clipping? Oh, 2 p.m. EST. Oh, what time is that on my time? Is that what, 10? No, 9? Horrible candy stream. It's fine. It's fine. 7 GMT. Oh, what? Okay. I will have to sort something out. No? No, no, no. Not bad time. Just need to reorganize some things. Because there is no way I'm missing the horrible candy stream. No way. Not happening. Because I want to be there to be ready for lots and lots of clipping. going to be special that is for sure <laughs> yeah it is talking about no dignity <laughs> I mean it, it could be worse I mean I could be looking to set up a um, a prediction for vomiting speaking of nasty foods the only thing I think is actually funny is when Brits hate on American foods but they have jelly deals and kidney pies in all fairness I don't eat either of those either of those But I'm trying to think what foods we take the mick out of. Or hate on, sorry. Because I'm a proper foodie, so I'll eat anything. Literally anything. Do you have something you hate? Like, I hate green peppers. Not really. 
American chocolate, pizza, and anything we overload with cheese. I mean, you're talking to a man who overloads everything with cheese. I may live in England, but I, I guess in some respects I eat like an American. I'm not sure. Pizza's pizza. As long as I can throw pineapple on it, I'm happy. An American chocolate? Well, I'm not a big fan of chocolate overall, really. Oh, did you ever try the grits? No. No, no, no. I haven't yet. I still have them. But I just haven't yet. So, if anything, I think my, like, food-wise is more Asian-inspired than anything else. But, yeah, you can't have a jacket potato without putting a mountain of cheese on it. Same as, like, you do a potato bake, it has to have layers of cheese. They last a long time, so that is good. I will have to buy some prawns this week and do it. Because I definitely want to do shrimp and grits. Give it a proper try. I've got a few recipes, actually, I've pinned for it. So I can definitely give those a go. Could you say this restoration trip was a success? Oh? Have you managed to get everything back? Hooray! You got back safely. That's the way to do it. Right. Do you know what? Talking of bees. Book of Binding. I don't want the occultism stuff. I want empty bee jars. Oh my god, they take so much glass. Okay. That's definitely a lot of glass for those. I definitely need to cook off some more. Got a bunch of shit. Nice. Yeah, I don't think there is actually anything that I don't like eating. I think the only thing that could really kind of kind of go towards it is just chocolate because I don't eat it that much and it's it's hilarious because I get shit loads of it for Christmas and like my birthday and stuff it's like I'm not a big fan it lasts me for ages for me it's mushrooms cucumber back wait a minute you don't like mushrooms mushrooms are amazing I love mushrooms. Cucumber and black licorice. Black licorice. I wouldn't say I hate it. I just don't pick it up. I quite happily eat it though. Mushrooms are, are not just yummy, delirious. They're amazing. Especially garlic breaded mushrooms. Oh, they taste the way a rotting log smells. <laughs> oh, where is it? That's because I know that you can like do it through. Um... Oh, what was it? Is it that one? So I'm trying to remember commands here. I think it's that because I know you can buy mushroom growing logs that you literally just put a little bit of water on. Mushrooms are like slugs. Slugs are banned from this household. Okay, I'm bringing you a mushroom log for Christmas. I only say Christmas because going the way lockdown is in the UK currently, that's probably the only time we'll be allowed back out again. Did that actually add the quote? No. Why not? If you're cold, they're cold. Bring them inside. 
Yeah, and no, I see, I love mushrooms. Absolutely love them. Oh, is it really? Oh, okay, it's just that. Right. Let's try this again. See if this works. Yes! There we go. Okay, it's added the game on there as well. We're fine. It's a shame. I don't know if there's the, like the mushroom biomes in this one. Right, let's go and have a look at Jamie's base and also see if we can get some more bees. Noki mushrooms in soups are fine. They don't have a taste, but portobello's taste like a fat man fired in your mouth. <laughs> <coughs> I'm sorry, that's got to be added too. That's that's beautiful. There we go. There we go. Oh, they have a taste, but a, like a fat man farted in your mouth. I mean, that's that's quite the statement. <laughs> I think those are number 11 and 12, Dale. <coughs> I think. All right, let's go and have a look at Jamie's base, because he started building. He's not just in a cave, which makes me look like I'm just hiding in a cave. Thanks, Joe. I was trying to find yours. Oh, I can't remember which one's yours. I hear a spider, though. Hello. John Blue the Crying. Hi, John Blue. Get out of it. Oh, I'll have your sword. Uh, Whoa, hello. Spaz Squiddy. Oh, no. No. We've got all the bosses around here. Let's just, just use the baby as a battering. <laughs> Beautiful. Where's that? That's kind of cool. Why is there no stairs, Jamie? Why have I got to, like, jump up everywhere? Oh, are you... Have you done some automation on them? Oh... Getting all fancy. There's a big drop there, mate. It kind of hurt. He's, he's not a spooder. He's John Blue. Which reminds me, I am loving that. Uh, so what? I'm a spider. You can have an egg. Right. Let's go bee hunting. Find the bees. Actually, do you know what? Which one was your quote? Because I'm curious now. I'm pretty sure, Del, yours may be number five.
I know number three is yours as well. Yeah, number three was definitely yours. That one doesn't have a name on it, so I'll have to add a name onto that one. Do you know what? Let's do that now before I forget, actually. There we go. Figure out how I want to format them all at some point. I think I've only got one. I think it's one. What the fuck is that? Mmm, bread. <laughs> yeah, Del, I think I've got like one left and then I've maxed. Well, Max completed the um, Spiral Abyss, the first eight floors. I think it's just the last last one or the one beforehand. Ancient Remains. Well, I mean, I'm digging it up, but okay. I want all the bone. I heard something then. This is where the ghost of a dragon is going to come out and fucking attack me, isn't it? What's my favourite word? Saying dumb shit in an Asian voice. Oh dear. I need to try it again now that I have more people up to level 90. Well, I mean... What is that? It's a husk spawner. I mean, the main reason I couldn't do a lot of them, like, top level was because I was being very, um, what's the word? Stubborn. Because I was refusing outright to, um, use teams that would actually be useful. Oh, hello. Block of Emerald. Thanks. Need lots of emerald. I'm guessing they're just not going to spawn in the daytime. Which I'm happy with. It means I don't get chased by a load of husks. Yeah, I was just being stubborn with my team. Well, that sounds dumb. I know. I know. I was... I was just being stubborn with it and refusing to actually put together a decent team that could actually handle the fights and, like, build them around... Um, what? Gravel B? Hi, Gravel B. Come here. Um, build them. I was just putting whoever I wanted to use in the, in the team instead of actually, like, building it around the elemental reactions. So now I'm using... I've, I've always got my main character just because he's got the highest level and does a decent amount of damage right now. Anywhere from, like, 1,000 to 6,000 a hit. Um, and then... Oh, RGB! Sorry. Shiny things. Um, then kind of focused more on ice and lightning, because Superconduct is hella powerful in those. That's a lot of bone. Hi, Snake. Leave me alone. And I shall leave you alone. Don't you shake your snaky butt at me. No, I was being attacked by cat cactus. Of course I was. Uh, yeah, let's go this way. I haven't been this way yet. So now I've actually got a decent team put together. Or decent-ish... Uh, decent-ish team. I'm actually doing a lot of damage really, really quickly. I was just being way too stubborn. More bees, please? Oh, it's daytime. Jay, can you sleep, dude? No stubborn. Okay. I will try. Is 
Thanks, Jay. I'll make myself a sleeping bag in a minute if I find any sheep. I think the next character can has bees. I hope so. <gasps> I see normal Minecraft bees. You know, I need to. There's bears. Um. Going through the bee book and had a quick search online. Can't think in anything about lifespan. Well, there must be one. Pardon the pun. Because they keep fucking off. Where are you? I know you're here somewhere. Uh, do you know what? I don't want any of that shit on me, thanks. There you are! Gotcha, little fucker. That's right, bee rage. The bees are so cute. <laughs> Yes, although they keep disappearing. I need to find some more iron bees. I think I found those in the uh, in the mountains, so I'm hoping I can find them again. Without breaking my legs would be kind of helpful. Whoa, okay. I nearly went down there. Wait a minute, I wonder. Okay, no, it's not gonna work. Aha, I already see a gold bee, and an osmium bee, and another osmium bee. Come here, there we go. Where did the little fucker go? There you are. Come here, you. Thank you. I'll have another gravel bee. Uh, I've already got two gravel bees. I'm going to find an iron bee. Jay, do you need any gravel? Jesus. Just gravel everywhere. Ah, sheep. Come here. I need to steal your wool. Because I need a sleeping bag. Thank you. Please, iron bee. Well, there's a nest over there, so hopefully they're like over that way a bit. I can't see any more bees. Ah! Stop trying to fall down a hole, you fool. <clears throat> Can I have speeds? 
entonces There's another RGB. Hello. Come here. Come here. There we go. Right, I now need an iron bead, please. And another gold one. That would be nice. Jay, did you say you needed a load of gravel? Because, like, not too far from your base, there is a mountain covered in gravel. That's a normal bee. I'm good for gravel. No worries. I know I spent ages hunting for some because there was none near me. I had to do all my mining under the water to get it. Please, please. Mm. Mount Gravioli, yes. Where is it? There you go, Mount Gravioli. I know where to go for gravel. Let's just pick up a little bit. And of course, I can now level up my weapon. They really need to find a way to make it so those gifts can actually appear on your screen as well, because that would be so much better. I won't miss them then. Hmm. Maybe to the north? There's a little bit more of the mountain up that way. Annoyingly, it's only the native bees that show up on the map. None of the like resource resourceful bees actually show up. Otherwise it makes it so much easier to find the little buggers. Hi Mr. Bear. Leave me alone and I'll leave you alone. It's all good. Just passing through. The hell? Bamboo forest. It is. And I can use those like sticks, I think. Or just for particular things. Oh, I can turn them into sticks. Okay. Paper wall. Okay. Scaffolding, yes. Bamboo bridges. Mm, okay. Bamboo ladders. Okay. Let's grab some. That should be enough. find some bees. No, not normal bees. I want proper bees. Or even a village. A village would be nice. I can go rob the villagers. Ow. 
Come on, my cranky legs. No worries, Dale. Just like fall from the ceiling. I don't know. I'm so glad I got some more emeralds though, because they're bloody hard to find. Right. It's a lot of bones. durability what about this what do we get on this chop efficiency speed has the sword got one yet no right got a few of these Honeycomb blocks and beeswax blocks. Okay. I definitely don't have enough for that yet. But at least I should have enough to make another one at level two, maybe? I wonder if we'll find a thing. There it is. And I need bottles. Thought I had more bottles than that. You mean forcibly redistribute wealth? Oh. Hold shift and right click block to press. Oh, for God's sake. Can't do it with a shield. There we go. Really? I got one beeswax from that? That's not good enough. Max B six. Okay. What? 
Oh, it's not grass, is it? It's bloody honeycombs. Oh, let's hope you can mix and match. You can. Good. Oh, really? Shit bags. Let's fix that. There we go. Let's try the RGB. Let's do two of those. There we go. And osmium. So I can't find that much of that at the moment. I know I need iron, but I haven't found the iron B yet. I'll go looking for them again in a minute. Don't think IGB combs are used for any crafts. Might be wrong. They, you get dyes from them, Jay. But, okay, he doesn't like tier 2. So I can't use osmium. I should be able to use gravel, though. I'm sure I caught two gravel bees. There we go. Bees, wax, and sugar. Doesn't like tier two. No, some of them need higher tiers of um, hives. That's why you can upgrade them. You can tell because when you put them, when you try and right click them on the hive, they don't go into it. So I don't know why it's not going into that one. Oh, they don't click onto the hive. You meant to click onto the hive, bud. Um, because like, here you go. Max time in hive. Ooh, dude, Kit, how the hell are you doing, man? How was your stream? Oh, you're playing Star Wars Battlefront Two. Awesome. I know you were saying that you were loving, wanting to play that again. Biomes, war motion. Okay, maybe I can't have him here, that's why. That's why I've already got two of them. Because, yeah, he won't go in. How's it going, man? Oh, I am good, mate. I'm good. How was the stream? Oh, Kath the Demon Slayer, thank you for the follow. Oh, do you know what? Let's put another RGB one in there, because why not? Do the normal Minecraft bees. The backlit villain. Thank you again for the follow. Hey Adele. So how was the stream, man? Oh yeah, okay. He won't go into a normal one. That was obvious. He's he's a vanilla one, I think. Maybe? Oh my god. There is a kitten bee. What? Catnip honeycombs? And an Oreo bee. What? Oh my god, you need one. Do it. Stream was good, man, but I got a headache, so I called it early. Oh, bless you, man. Hopefully it goes away, doesn't like stick around too long. I will make the cat bees. Don't you worry. I'll make them just for you, Del. On the other SMP I'm on, someone decided to spawn three withers. Oh, well, that was a genius idea. Really, I'm getting confused with this. 
Ender Beacon pre prevents bees from teleporting in a 10 block radius. What the hell is that? Right. Is there actually a book for resourceful bees? Yes, there is. I'm at 50 Shades of Bee. I forgot about that. How I forgot about that, I don't know. Pretty sure Rid's the one who named it that. You had me as soon as I saw the beard. <laughs> Thank you very much. I need to straighten the damn thing, though. It is getting a little bit out of control. Right, let's leave those bees out there for a minute and see what they actually bloody do. Hopefully they don't disappear. There you go, 50 shades of bees. Okay. How and where bees spawn, how bees can be bred, what bee traits, uh, whatever. Uh, special requ bees require special traits. A trait can be given to bee. Oh, okay. What about just like looking after them? Pack developers, if you have any questions, okay, whatever. Can I click on that? Does it go away? Yes, it does. The same, but with lockdown, the third, I can't be bothered to sort it. I mean, mine have just been growing wild anyway. Thank you for the hydrate, man. I've still got some coffee left, so it's all good. <sighs> good old coffee. But... I've just kind of got a kink in mine that I'm trying to get rid of. And it's not from wearing a mask, although it looks like it. It's definitely not from wearing a mask. Even my fave, fave fuzz is getting out of hand, needs a nice trim soon. I know. I need to, like, properly sort mine out because occasionally my hair keeps tickling my ears while I'm wearing my headset as well. Which definitely doesn't help. Right. Tiered beehive is a massive upgrade from the vanilla. Tiered hive is also the only hive which support generation of our custom honeycombs, other than the apiary. Okay. When a bee like, oh, yeah, 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 that's how a fucking thing works. How should be collected in two ways? First, when enabled, whatever, shear, scraper, Dis dispenser, and some redstone. If a tiered hive has not been smoked prior to collecting the bees, will release and become angry does that mean they run away though I, I, I'm not sure uh, cheers dude straight up a bit oh. getting into a slump honeycomb basics no it's not that that's just the tiered beehives again Spawn rate, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's special spawnings. That's fine. Okay. Oh, Jay, I think you have to actually keep, like, breeding them like you would do sheep and stuff in this. Bees can only be bred in the world. Optionally, an APA breeder can be used to breed the bees. Oh, okay. So. I'm wondering if breeding cost blocks on materials that match. Yeah, but. How, how do you know which ones it is? Is breedable true? Parents, coal bee and aluminium bee. Some of two iron bees breed new iron bee. Need iron blocks each to breed. So you, what, you feed them each an iron block? Because, I mean, you can get an iron bee from coal and aluminium. 
Wait a minute, what do you need for that one? Okay, the, oh, the kitten bee isn't breedable. What do you mean each eight blocks? So you need to feed them each eight blocks. Because where are you seeing that in the book? Where am I going insane? Right click the bee in the GUI. I, I, I did. Is breedable true? But you're saying eight blocks. There's no mention of eight here. Oh, right. With you now. We really need tulips. That'll be why the iron bee buggered off then. Oh no, that's any. Okay. A coal bee and an aluminium bee. I need to get a coal bee. Looks like I'm going bee hunting again. Where's the RGB? Where is it? RGB. Oh really? You breed it by giving it flowers? That's it, because I've got a whole factory of flowers being set up after. So they had to change my pierogi order f from normal potato to bacon cheddar. Both things I shouldn't eat, but love eating. Let's just say I'm a b ball of unpleasant gas right now, properly being punished. <laughs> oh, I feel so sorry for Morak. <laughs> oh dear. Of course he's a special one. You shouldn't. His normal farts are worse than my bad ones. <laughs> like proper chemical warfare with you two. Yeah, no, I did read that in the um, thing, Joe. Now that I know there's actually another tab I need to read. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's sleep so that I can get the RGBs thing so I can see if I can breed them. Truth, we had to buy really good candles for the house. I mean, I wouldn't rec recommend candles with that much gas floating around the house. <laughs> that could be dangerous. Okay. So, if I feed you... It worked. What? You took all of it? You shit. Come here, I'll grab a stack then. Have they all just fucked? They've all fucked off. Right, come here. Is he coming to me? Because I've got his, his... Oh my god! No, 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 no. I'm sorry, Mr. RGP. Yeah, I feed you. I feed you. Oh, you sting me. Okay, fine. Please don't sting me. Parrots and the bats. Oh my god, there's so many bees. Oh my god, they're like a little swarm now chasing me. Oh shit. Well, I accidentally hit one of them. I didn't mean to. I have presents. It's a little diddy RGB. Look at him. Oh, okay. They're just going to keep following me because I've got that in my hand. Should I take it away? Okay, there we go. They've gone back about their business now. They have gone back about their business. I just really hope that the bees aren't accidentally flying into this. Because that will kill them. 
Okay. I'm not the only one who saw that, right? That yeah, bee just disappeared. About their business. Look. I just really hope that the bees aren't turn around flying into this. After, like, just doing myself that some damage here. I turn around and he goes puff. He disappears. So what is going okay. on with these bees? I'm not the only one who saw that, right? CJ, it was nothing to do with anything else. He just disappeared. Right, what do these ones turn into? Something, at least? Maybe not. They just turn into slowly different uh, colour changing blocks. Okay, that'll do. But, but where did the rest of them go? Don't tell me I've already lost my RGBs. Is it because there are no flowers in the immediate area for them to like use? Because there's definitely some over there. Damn it, I need to grab Rid when he next appears find out what I'm doing wrong. Oh, no, okay. So there, there are still bees here. There's one little bee. He still hasn't fully grown. He's got another five and a bit minutes before he's fully grown. Oh no. So there's a number of reasons why they can die, Jamie. And I think I may not have helped this. They'll die automatically. They'll die shortly after they sting you. So me hitting one of them, or even a mob randomly hitting them, will kill them. Because they'll sting me and then they'll die. Campfires hurt them. Which doesn't help. Because I know you've got campfires underneath yours at the minute um, they get hurt by water the campfire should be fine as long as it's directly on it uh, the hive is directly on it uh, also put a lot of flowers inside if they don't get nectar okay Half slabs because they can go through them and get pushed by the bees. And they need to be at least five blocks high if you put them in a room. Oh. Okay. Definitely need to go bee hunting then and get a decent set of bees. Right. Where's the nearest mountain range? Over that way. I have breads on me. Right? It's all good. We has breads. If you put them in a building, the building needs to be five blocks high, otherwise they can't fly properly. And they need to have lots and lots of flowers available if you're gonna put them in a room. Because if there's not enough nectar, they'll die. But they will definitely die if they sting you. Like all three of the adult RGBs that I've just put into the thing did, because I accidentally hit one of them while trying to fight off a mob.
I mean, if I can get an aluminium and a coal bee, then I'll be happy. Because then I can try breeding some iron bees. Just set up a massive area for them or something and just put loads of flowers down. Squids having the time of their life over there. But yeah, I just need to find out where the cat bee is and then I can go and find it. And until I've got a grip on how all the bee stuff works, I'm not doing anything with it. I will keep that bee in a jar. Right, there's another gravel bee. There you go, I've got four of the little buggers now. Do it! Wait a minute. Okay, so where do we get the kitty bee then? The kitten bee. So I might actually bump into the kitten bee up here. Don't worry, if I find it, I will capture it and I will see if I can rename it as well. Hi pig. That's another gravel bee. Yes, it is. But there's the hive. Right. I will redeem the name channel points if you do. <laughs> I thought you might. I will name it and then I'll put it back in the jar just because I, I don't want to risk it until I know exactly what I'm doing with these bees and how to actually look after them. Right, there must be bees over here because I see another nest. Where are you bees? I know you're is here. <laughs> as long as the kitten bee behaves exactly like that, I am happy. That is a weird ass way for this to spawn. one. I'll definitely take the iron though. Of course it's going to be an RGB. Now I know the RGB is pretty much useless to me. Ah, wait a minute. Sleeping bag time. <coughs> Such a weird generation though.
Hello, Tin B. Thank you. That's the Skelly Bob B. I need him because I got rid of my last one. I say got rid, he died. Thank you. Come here. <coughs> oh my god, slimes, really? That bloody time I found some. Uh, excuse me. What the hell are you doing? Okay, I have to give the guy who made the, the like animal mod in this some serious props. Because not only was that gator looking pretty like a gator, but the mother trucker actually grabbed me, pulled me away, and then started trying to spin my limbs off. That was coded very well. I can't believe I just fell down that hole. Right. Ignore that. Death roll. I know. It's. I was wondering what the hell was going on and then realised it was an alligator. And I'm like, fair play, the guy who's coded this has done really well. It's exactly how I'd expect them to behave. Please, bees. I'll be your friend. I'll try not to hit you this time. <gasps> That's a gravel bee. Hello, obsidian bee. You're coming with me, definitely. And I'm definitely going to nick this. I'm waiting ages to try and find one of these in the wild. Well, it has no chest. Why it has no chest? That's kind of pants. These things are normally meant to have a chest. Where is it in here? Ignore the fact I'm swimming in lava. I have complete fire immunity. Thanks to one of my trinkets. Oh, hello. Uh, zinc bean, I guess. Alright, I'll have you. I want iron, damn it. Or coal, actually. Oh no, because then I'd need aluminium. I definitely need at least two iron bees. Uh, screw it, let's carry on going south. Sure, we'll find another mountain. legs I need my special healing bread uh, 
Uh, there is no safe way to break glass, unfortunately, Jamie. It depends what type of glass, though, because you can make the stronger versions that don't actually break when you break the block. Okay, I have a feeling that's going to go that way. So, let's go this way. Maybe we'll find some ruins. Yeah, normal glass, you're kind of stuck. You break it, it goes. Oh my god, have I got a dolphin? I do! Oh, why is the dolphin attacking me? He's not, I'm drowning. Okay. I forgot about dolphins. Water bees? I'm sure there was another one here just a minute ago. Blaming the dolphin. Well, I thought it was the dolphin. It wasn't the dolphin in the end. It was my lack of oxygen. There's the other water bee. Got him. Right. Let me get through the forest, damn you. Oh, laptop, wake up. blame the dolphin. It's fine. Oh my god. This place is a nightmare to run through. That's definitely a weird place. Not a biome I'm used to seeing. Wait, jump up the cliff, you fool. Right, I'm sure there must be something in here instead of it just being a giant rock. Only one way to find out. No, it looks like it's just a giant rock. Whoops, I'm hungry. Where's Miyama? There it is. Right. Let's use Miyama instead. Just because it's got the durability takes longer to burn out. Right, okay. So it is definitely just a random block. Fine. It's like rock but a little boulder. Oh my god. <laughs> Where is Buster when you need him? You definitely get points for the very quickness on that one. Uh, let's go south. Oh, it's a trash panda. What is that over there? Don't recognize those things. I would try jumping into the water from here, but knowing my luck, I will miss.
see some bees. Hello, Skelly Bee. Gotcha. Zombie bee, stop hurting yourself in the water. You fool. Okay. I'm put down my sleeping bag. Screw it. South we go. Brown. <laughs> is that is is that gif your answer to the uh, current gas status? Definitely an enemy there. Don't know what it is. I see some dolphins there, so let's see if we can get their help. I don't know what it is that's currently swimming for me though. Right. Yes, with the dolphins. random beehives out in the middle of nowhere. Oh, I lost my dolphins. That odd shape. Oh, there's another one of those portals down there. And there is a chest on that one. Right, okay. So let's go. What is with the weird water void? Are you seeing this on my screen? It's literally just the water stop. It's holy water. <laughs> <gasps> Finally. I know I'm also looking for bees, but I was also looking for a pirate ship. And a 
time I see another warby. Hi, Waterby. God, that can take too long. I do kind of need a water breathing trinket, but at the same time I should have really brought a door with me. Because you can be sneaky and use doors. Like that. Buried treasure map. Ooh. I want some treasure. That's the bugger I was after. I want the diamonds and the emeralds in it. <laughs> Night, Jesse. Thanks for stopping by. I'm going to speak to you tomorrow. I'll try and find where my buried treasure is. Guess it kind of looks like that. Maybe. That's that's a shark. put all this stuff back because I can always just do slash back god so many random things Can I use the obsidian ones? <laughs> <coughs> Who tooted? You're gonna get you can only capture blaze bees. That's good to know. Right. <coughs> ah, 
minimum group size of two. Okay. Maybe that's the bit I was we were missing out on Jay as well. See, he went in. Okay, I can't feed him anymore. Where's the other one? Come out, Liz. Please come out. I think it's because it's getting close to night time. Let me sleep. Come here, V. Where'd you go? I have some tasty gravel for you. I'm not going insane, am I? The other one definitely went in the hive. those bees there as well. Oops. We've already got a coal bee. Didn't realise I had one of those. Can we smoke the other bugger out? Um. There was no other gravel bee that came out. Do I have to go find another one? Where'd he go? Come here. Just in case, right? Wait a minute. There's the other one. Now he's come out of play. Okay. And one of the bees has just disappeared. I've just seen the smoke. They made a little baby gravel bee. Where does it tell you what flowers they need? This looks like they just need anything. Yeah, except any Minecraft flowers. That's fine. Okay, so that one's done. What about the coal bee? There you go, we've got the coal bee. Do we have an aluminium bee? I thought it took almost all the flowers. Yeah, they do. It's just trying to make sure you've got the right ones there. Creeper, lead, water, skeleton. Skeleton. Two of those. Of course I've not got an aluminium bee. Oh well. Hopefully they won't just disappear and die this time. Wait why is he still a little baby bee? Oh, he's going to grow up in a sec. Okay, let's let's capture him because unfortunately you are the last RGB. So we'll capture you as a baby and hide you away. That's the hope, anyway. Flares? Stay with us. I 
Actually, what does the coal beak need? Blocks of coal, of course he does. Modified gravelly mountains. <laughs> nice. See, that just looks like it can appear anywhere. Tier 1 apiaries need nether stars. Of course they do. <coughs> I'm going to have to fight a wither at some point, Joe. I'm not looking forward to that on this pack. It'll be fine. Right, have you got any of these bees that we can try and start like breeding them? Because I've got a zombie one. I think I've only got one of them. Wait a minute, I've got, I've got two coal bees. Oh, right, sorting that straight the fuck out. Let me have the damn dog. I don't know where the other one went though. That's fine though. Uh, what do I want? I want the smoker and I want shears. There they are. Alright, I see you. Are you the one I've already fed? I think you are. That's the one I haven't fed yet then. Oh, mate, look, 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 I've got some tasty coal. Come with me. And you. That's it. There you go. <coughs> what the fuck was that? Spirit of birthing. Some tasty coal. I, I don't even think I want to ask what you think I said. <laughs> Tasty coal. Did not sound like coal. <laughs> Seriously, do, do I even dare ask what you think I said? Spirit of birthing, those bees had haunted junk. <laughs> Definitely had some haunted junk. Right. Now that you've got a taste for that beautiful honey, it's time to set aside these bee labored manual practices and get all buzzy automating into the all new and improved centrifuge. Perfect for extracting that golden goodness. Oh my god. Dinosaurs and. Oh my god. <laughs> Dinosaurs and bread. Um, centrifuge increases the efficiency of the honeycomb processing at the cost of energy. Okay. Is that really that easy to fucking make? If someone making it. Right, run away. Bees are having trouble breeding because they always aim for the bee hole. <laughs> oh, that one's got to go in there. Right. 
That one had to go in there. Uh, iron and... Oh, okay, I need a piston as well. Oh, right. I need a piston. I need to make one. Not that I can use it yet, but we have that. So it gave me a gold bee. Ah, oh, you beauty. You can go in there safe and sound in a minute. What else do we have? Multi-block centrifuge. Now we're in beesness. You know what they say, go big or go home. Well, it doesn't get any bigger than this. With, this, with the basics of honeycomb processing behind you, Time to turn it up to 11 and upscale production. While the multi-block centrifuge requires more materials to craft and more space to set up, it will pay for itself before you realise it. It's also capable of processing honeycomb blocks in addition to standard honeycombs and buds through multiple inputs at once. Once you've collected all the necessary blocks, you can use your 50 Shades of Bees book to visualise the structure, which should help with the correct block placement. Okay. Centrifuge... What happened there? Right, centrifuge casings, I need 39 of. And each one of those, seriously? Oh, wait a minute, I can use aluminium as well as iron. Okay. I've got bugger all aluminium, but it's a start. Definitely gonna have to go do a lot more mining. But if that's the case, let's go do some cheeky mining now. Because then it will be really silly to see exactly how that works. Uh, let's make a few more of those hammers. Oh, Jay, you know what I was saying about the um, silly way that I've got to uh, go mining at the moment. Yeah, give me a second, I'll show you. Let me just don my mining hat and put away my hammers. Uh, let's quickly repair my pick. Use string for that. Okay. And diamond for that. It's not a problem. I think I only need one diamond, but never mind. Yeah, there we go. Right. No more bees go poof? No. Okay, fine. Time to go mining. Yeah, quiet, zombie. I'll get to you in a minute. Oh, I'll get to you guys now. Whoops. Oh, do you know what? Really? I don't want to have to... Bloody shield. Okay, fine. Come on in. Suck a dick. don't need much more redstone, but I need a lot of iron, so... Yeah, I got them as a reward. <laughs> but it's fine, it's fine. 
they don't do any damage to the player. They just do damage to um, blocks. And now I've used them all. Oh, I'll have the gold. Wow, this is getting a little bit flaky now. Uh, excuse you. Forgetting that I don't have to worry about lava as well. So I've been avoiding it and running away from it when I was doing this earlier. Completely forgetting that I'm lava proof. How did I not find this cave under my base before? Well, of course I've got honing available. some more foods. That's not food. That is. Zombie's definitely not fireproof. Whoops. I need to get a thing to water and feed myself. Pretty sure there was a mod ages ago that used to do that, but it was like a Pez dispenser.
Did I seriously throw a diamond on the floor? I did. It's fine. Here we go. Uh, haven't found any more walls yet, I want. these here I'll take the book I don't want the cardboard <laughs> fucking cardboard uh, oh I'll take the recall potion no I don't need those I'll take the rusty iron I'll definitely take the enchanted book and the ancient tomes Random, random smithing equipment under Drown Joe. What is that? Well, that's iron. What is this? Black cave crystal. That looks kind of funky. I want some of that. <coughs> Even if just for decoration. Jay, the only problem with uh, mining this way is it occasionally freaks out because I'm wearing a lighting helmet. What the happened there? I accidentally mine everything under my feet. Well, it's because I'm wearing a miner's hat. It keeps having to redo all the light. Oh no, I lost that. It keeps having to redo all the light levels. So it, the game freaks out as I'm moving around a little bit. Well, it doesn't help when I do that either. Luckily, I've got the right trinket for the job. Definitely gonna have to stay super late tonight. Oh, that sucks. I mean, how late is super late? another hour and a half so trying to work out time so it's half five there now
Yeah, we're probably going to eight. Oh man. Yeah, five thirty. We'll probably have to stay to seven. Oh, that sucks. Sorry, my math bad. <laughs> it's okay. It's been a long ass Tuesday. I mean, I don't didn't have to stay late today, but I do have to do extra tomorrow. So I start at 6 a.m. tomorrow. Gotta love an early start. I need a decent amount of iron. Come on. Nearly used an entire hammer, Jay. Didn't even get two stacks of iron. That sucks. low rate of iron. Yeah, I mean, I've got a load of iron dust already, because from where I've got the crusher up, to, up and running. What's that? I've got three, nearly four stacks of iron ore. Hi, Gravel Bee. <coughs> Alright, let's get this processing. I'm going to call it there for today though, <coughs> mainly because now I've just got to spend hours mining and hunting for iron bees, and I have got an early one tomorrow, so I should really go to bed, but we are going to raid Amy, just because we can, so let me just get that set up, there we go, so thank you very much for everyone who stopped by, I will be back again on... Friday, yeah, Friday doing some more of this, and also got, obviously, the anime watch party tomorrow night in the CTS as well, so we will be doing that, but I shall definitely do some off-camera stuff, just building up all the resources that I actually need and getting everything ready to finish upgrading the base, but until then, I shall see you on Friday, please make sure to go give some Amy some love, give her a load of aggro as well, just because we can. But I shall see you later.